Many gun rights advocates fear a new attack on the Second Amendment with the new government in Washington. Some are taking a page from their liberal opponents and applying it to the gun issue. National correspondent William Lajeunesse tonight from Los Angeles on the concept of Second Amendment sanctuaries. It won't stop until we beat the NRA. President Biden's plan to rewrite America's gun laws makes gun owners nervous. I'm going to do everything in my power, in office or out of office, to get those assault weapons off the street, which I've done once already, and to get those clips that have multiple bullets in them not for sale. If the feds want to come in and start taking people down um, for having a high capacity magazine, uh, we're not going to have any part in that. State Rep Leo Basucci wants to make Arizona a Second Amendment sanctuary state, banning the use of state money or manpower to enforce any federal law or regulation that violates the right to bear arms. This bill is saying they can do what they want in D.C., but um, we're not going to have our law enforcement spend resources um, to help them arrest law-abiding citizens who are, who, are, who are gun owners. Four states and more than 400 mostly red cities and towns passed measures declaring themselves gun sanctuaries, modeled after blue state rules that protect illegal immigrants from federal law. There is no substance behind this. It's theater. It's spectacle. While opponents call gun sanctuary laws symbolic, they do fear their effect. It is anti-American and deeply troubling that anyone would run for office and push something like this. They're denying support for citizens in their, their state who are impacted by gun violence. Gun advocates fear local police will be enlisted to enforce a national gun registry, confiscate guns, and limit the sale of ammunition. Opponents say courts, not states, define the Second Amendment, but some fear Biden will issue rules and regs bypassing gun protections. Last week, Governor Abbott said he supports making Texas a Second Amendment sanctuary state. Brett. William, thank you. A New York state judge is rejecting a bid by the National Rifle Association to dismiss, put on hold, or transfer a lawsuit by New York's attorney general seeking its dissolution. The decision comes just days after the NRA filed for bankruptcy protection and said it planned to reincorporate in the more gun-friendly state of Texas after 150 years in New York.